So anyways, here I am on a Thursday afternoon. Yeah, buddy. Um, uh, it's raining wherever I'm at, wherever that's at. Um, and I got this awesome thing right here. You know what this is? Yeah, no. Maybe you do, maybe you don't. Who gives a fuck? Hmm. I need my pot. I need my pot, man. Anyways, this is a beautiful backyard that I'm blessed to be able to come out and see every morning if I want to. Pretty, huh? Yeah, I'm pretty blessed right now. Life's good. I'm glad I moved out of Monterey County. I thought I'd never I thought that I'd never see the day where I wouldn't miss my hometown where I was born and raised. I don't miss anything about it. I don't miss the spots. Yeah, I miss I miss some people, you know. I do, but not that bad where I feel like I need to go and see them or go back at all. Like, not even close, sorry to say. Not even close. I don't know. I think my uh, sobriety... Um is more important and my well-being and my health you know I did have a job <clears throat> before I left Salinas I worked at Tom's Liquors in Prunedale which was an experience it was kind of cool I mean I <clears throat> I pretty much uh, man I took, I took care of everything by myself and it was my first real job ever um outside of prison and shit um so it was crazy, like closing the st closing the store at night by myself, counting all the money, counting lottery tickets, selling alcohol and tobacco. That was crazy. What a crazy first job! It was really overwhelming. But um, yeah, I don't want to like go off track here, but yeah, I did have a job. It was cool, um, but I had some things that just were weighing me down on my back just weighing me down like it was like a dark cloud over me there and I was either gonna end up dead or I was just gonna lose my end up losing my car you know and everything else everything else was falling apart around me man went to jail you know and I just oh it was horrible um but yeah I was blessed by his wonderful family to, you know, come out here, wherever here's at, and, um, it's cool, and I got a job within the first two weeks of me being here, uh, I need to put some cover up on or something, actually, I don't care, I don't give a fuck, um, but yeah, I love my life, it's cool, and I don't miss Salinas, and I don't want to go back there for nothing, you know? Oh, yeah, and today is my great-grandfather's 92nd birthday. 92nd birthday. He's in one of those, um, what do you call it? Uh, not, I want to say call it a rest home or convalescent. Uh, a post, a, a post-acute facility. And, um, yeah, I lost my, lost my vava, my great-grandmother, uh, last summer. And unfortunately, I was in jail, or I don't know, maybe it was better I was in jail, because I just, I love my vava, and I love my vavu. He's the only person I'd go back there for, like, if he was on his deathbed, or he got really sick or something, he's the only one I'd go for. I won't even go for my aunt, one of my aunts who lives in New York. And she was supposed to come out here <clears throat> uh, before Christmas, like around this time, this time right now. But she couldn't because of all this stupid <coughs> COVID-19 <coughs> shit. Like, I mean, I'm not downplaying it or like trying to minimize the situation of it or the criticalness of it. But yeah, I mean what the fuck's going on? Like, I, I, I don't know. It's just weird. 
a lot of people are dying, but I haven't, I don't know, whatever. Yeah, this COVID shit, I don't really care for it. It's ridiculous. It's just some kind of um, something, cover up something. Cover up 19. Huh. Co cover up your <coughs> COVID-19. Mask up. <laughs> Who gives a fuck? Yeah, you think people would be robbing banks more and shit, like, or, you know, just doing more shit because you guys have to wear a mask. <clears throat> awesome. Shit. Doesn't even, like, you walk in with a mask and rob somebody. Rob it, whatever. I don't know. Here we go. Here we go. I'm thinking stupid shit again. Yeah, I left that thinking behind, too, when I left Salinas. I mean... I think of, like, criminal things, but I just don't do them anymore. I'm like, oh, wow, that car's unlocked. Hmm, oh, fuck, I wonder what the fuck I could get in there. You know, yeah, I think like that still. You know, come on, man. You know, a tiger can't really change its... Or, I don't know how that saying goes, but... Uh, the tiger can't change its stripes or some shit like that. Well, whatever. As long as I... I could think all I want, but as long as I don't act on it, then, uh, I think I should be good, right? I don't know if anyone agrees or understood what the fuck I just said, but, yeah, um, I don't even think anybody's watching this shit right now. They're just me, myself, and I. Well, anyways, enough about all that. Um, shit. I don't know what, what started this shit. Oh, yeah, me smoking this joint. That's right. Back to the weed. Toodaloo.